the 2015 Agricultural Leadership Exchange trip experienced German energy production firsthand during its 10-day trip to Germany and Belgium. Germany leads the world in wind energy production and has helped finance over 10,000 biogas facilities in the country. The group visited four dairy operations with biogas producing digesters using manure and silage to generate energy in the form of heat and electricity for the farm and in some cases local homes and businesses. Farm operators explained it was profitable to install the equipment that was heavily subsidized by the government because inputs were readily available and they were guaranteed a 20-year fixed rate price for energy supplied to the grid. comment was made by the, this last one that we're at right now that if I hadn't started it when I did, if I was to start it today, I don't know if I would go there. He also made the comment that dairy production right now is not profitable, but he's got to stick with it for at least the next 20 years because that's what it's going to take to pay off on this plant here. The second concern, and we heard it from a gentleman this morning, is the holler that we're using product for food that's going for fuel. Now, the other flip side of the coin is we need the energy for electricity, for fuel also. So where do they share? What they're using here and in the two operations today was not taking the protein out and using it for food side they're using the whole product. Taking energy independence to the next level, the Zabek Bioenergy Park is a 225-acre facility with seven wind turbines, 24,000 solar modules, and two biogas converters. We have two biogas plants. We have one biologic waste fermentation plant and one agricultural biogas plant. The waste fermentation plant uh, uses um, biologic waste from the 24 towns and communities around Zabek. Um, and then we have the agricultural biogas plant that uses corn and slurry as input materials. Um, both of these plants have a cap capacity of one megawatt, one megawatt electric capacity. Um, and in the whole bioenergy park, we have uh, 29 megawatts of electric capacity installed. And this is enough to produce over 250% of the electricity that we need in Zabek. Next week, the group visits a relocated farm built on a coal mine and visits a unique brewery in Belgium.